What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we actually went through the outskirts of Mount Pyre, discovered that Team Aqua went in and, dis and stole the red orb, and we also found out that Team Magma stole the, the blue orb, you know, that kind of stuff. And uh, we're going to get to that, we're going to get to both those motherfuckers uh, later, but we're going to have to go down to Route 122 because there's a little bit more that we actually can find right here. Now off screen, I did sell some of the items that I didn't need and all that stuff, bought a few things at the department store, taught a Pokemon here and there, some new moves and all that fun stuff, because you know what, I can, and I will, you know, that kind of stuff. And uh, this is usually the place that everybody just misplaces, Route 123. And uh, what you definitely need is a cut technique right here. And luckily for us, we do have Skyblade. It does know the uh, technique, the two for one deal right there. And uh, you know what? This is perfect, this is perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna switch them off right here. I'm gonna put Raphael because I did teach, a few, uh, like I said, I taught a few Pokemon some new moves right here. So here we go. I lay in ambush, and a trainer has landed in my trap. No, I, I already knew you were there. I just brought my this parasol. My cutest should be up by a third. Okay. Alrighty, so here we go. Bring it on. Ninja Boy Jonas, not from the Jonas Brothers, and Parasol Lady Kaylee want to battle, and they're coming out with a coughing and a cast form right here. Oh, it looks like cast form might... It might help me out. It might. Alright, so we're going to go with a Solar Beam on you, and we're going to take away that with a Sunny Day. Kind of forgot that, yes. And, <laughs> look at that! Cast Form helped us out, and, uh, well, it changed its form, like I said, and, uh, it failed. Wow. Okay, so that was a big, uh, big mix, a mix-up right there. Okay. Never mind. And, uh, wow, Thunder Attack paralyzes Raphael. And the sunlight is strong. All right, get ready for get ready for a flamethrower attack. But here we go, flamethrower for the win. On to cast form. It gets boosted up because of that sunny day. You screwed yourself, Scarab Cast Form. You screwed yourself. And uh, all right, Shroom Lee going with a Solar Beam attack. Look at that. Oh, not super effective, crud. Oh crud, oh crud, oh crud, so that, that's not good, that is not good at all, and uh, wow, Shroom Lee gets busted up, just like that. Okay, so, I gotta go with the Mega Drain, and I gotta go with the Body Slam right here. So here we go with the Mega Drain, what does it do? No, it turns into a Fire type, it doesn't take much out, crud, this is bad, this is bad, and there goes that Flamethrower, so, Something that I wanted to do kind of backfires on me because of this goddamn cast form. Crap. Alright. Swamp Lord, let's do this. That's right, Swamp Lord's gonna destroy you right here. The blink of an eye. There we go. Blink of an eye. That's right, you're paralyzed. How does it feel? How does it feel? And uh, that sunlight is strong and strong and strong. Holy crud. Okay, so let's go with the muddy water and rock smash for that win. Muddy water, let's take a crap on this cast form. Bye bye cast form. That's right. Doesn't feel so good. Everybody gets experience points, and yes, Shroom Lee gets beaten by a cast form. Oh god. Okay, never mind. Okay, so I gotta revive my Pokemon right now. Let's see. Key items. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's the revives. Alright, Shroom Lee. WTF, man. WTF. Full heal, let's go with that guy, and uh, well, we got another guy right here, so let's go with Noob Cybot. We're going to be battling a lot of people, guys. This is, this is what the episode's all about, battling people, and here he is. This guy's like, being psychic is all about willpower. I willed myself or it not to lose to anyone. That makes me strong. Okay. All right. Not so strong. Let's see which which strong you are. The Cameron coming out with the Soul Rock crud. Oh man, I I, I I really need to learn some or I really need to remember some of my Pokemon right here. So I'm gonna have to switch it up to Swamp Lord. I don't want that mess happening again. Here we go, Swamp Lord. Swamp Lord ready. And there's that cosmic power. I think that will increase his defense, right? Will it? Yeah. Yeah, the defense is increasing, special defense is increasing, but that won't save you because I got Surf Attack. 
you're, you're pretty much a two Pokemon for one, but you're classified as a rock type Pokemon, which I kind of don't get. There we go. There we go. And Gaia grows to level 37. That's good. And Psychic Cameron's been defeated. Yeah, you feel sad. Sad. And, uh, yeah, we will battle again, so you, you're gonna be willing through more ass kickings from me afterwards. Alrighty, so that's done right there. Now, if you go right here and talk to this young lady, she's gonna be like, I love grass type Pokemon. Do you have any grass type Pokemon? And if you do, she's gonna be like, Oh, you like grass type Pokemon too, don't you? I'm so happy. You can have this. It's a token of our friendship. And we get ourselves the TM19. I believe it's Giga Drain, right? Yeah, I check trees with my grass type Pokemon, and I'm like a tree doctor. Let's see, I think it's Giga Drain, right? Could be Giga Drain. Hold on. Yes, it is Giga Drain. I think I should teach that to him, right? Yes, Shroom Lee can learn Giga Drain. So let's go ahead and uh, teach it Giga Drain and uh, take away Mega Drain. Let's see. Oh, look at that. It steals half. Okay, alrighty. So there we go, Giga Drain. That's good. That's the next thing, the next step of the absorb attack. Now here we have a few uh, berries right here. We might as well pick them out, right? Should pick them out. And uh, let's see, grab that citrus berries. There we go. Grabbing citrus berries because we can. And uh, here we go, another Ross berries. Alrighty. Okay, so that's pretty much it right there. Now you have an option right here. Pretty much a lot of options. Battle a lot of trainers. It's it's gonna be a it's gonna be a lot of decision making right here and uh, yeah the one thing I don't want to do is battle Puchianas all over the place don't I really don't so let's go right ahead and put some repel on just so we don't get attacked by any of these Pokemon right here so got to go back to the items and I did buy myself a buttload of items buttload of uh, super repels and uh, well, we got a double battle right here I'm going to go with Shroom Lee. And uh, Raphael, you know, do that combination that we like. Mount Pyre, where the spirits of Pokemon sleep. Will your Pokemon sleep? I don't know. This guy's like, when there are no Pokemon, or when there are no trainers around, I let my Pokemon battle each other. I watch them. Okay. It's kind of weird. Kind of weird, bro. Kind of weird. Okay, so here we go. Hex Mania, Kindra, and Collector Ed want to battle. And we got ourselves a Duskull and a Zangusi. Zangusi. Alrighty. Alright, so what I'm gonna do first is I gotta get some HP from this guy. And I'm gonna use this. Okay, well, I kinda wanted to use Sunny Day, but I pressed that button a little too quickly right there. And, uh, there we go. Slash attack. Holy crud. Nearly takes me out. So here we go with the Giga Drain. Not much different. I thought it would have like a cool, uh, cool effect or cool uh, animation or something like that. And they're still trying to attack my Shroom Lake because it's uh, brutally beaten. So you know what? I'm gonna go with a flamethrower to you. So there we go, flamethrower for the win. That's right. No more Zangusi. That's right, Zangusi, you've been defeated. And uh, well, let's see, who are they gonna come out? Is it a Viper? Wow, how does that work? If so Viper and Sangoos are blood enemies and they and they attack each other on sight. How does that work? As a Pokemon trainer, how do you prevent from those two Pokemon to attack each other? I just want to know. That that is like a confusing that is a one of the questions of life that we uh we always ask. So I'm gonna go with this guy and I'm gonna Yeah, I'm gonna go with Body Slam on this guy right here. That's right. Body slam. And there's the Giga Drain. The only animation changes, you know, green background, I guess. And uh, look at that. No more potions for this guy. And he's coming out with a crunch attack. So Viper, you are a... Oh, God. So we got to defeat the Shuppet real quick. And, well, the Shuppet's defeated quickly. It just killed itself. Wow. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I don't know. Okay. All right, guy. And uh, you're afflicted by the curse. Not much of a... Not much of anything, so I'm just gonna do uh, do what it is right here. Just attack them, beat them. The curse won't affect me very much afterwards. Okay, that 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 did something. Come on, Raphael. There's that poison tail attack. Nearly beats Raphael. Crud. But 
there we go. That's how the cookie crumbles on that one. Everybody's getting experience points, and we defeated these guys. Collector Ed, you are, you are, you, you suck, man. You suck balls. Okay, so I gotta heal up my Pokemon. You know, it's always nice to heal Pokemon, you know, because uh, we need to. And uh, we're gonna give that Hyper Potion to Raphael, and uh, I should be switching it off right here to Swamp Lord because. There are quite a, a few other trainers right here, and luckily we do have the cut technique. Don't need to go back and forth or switch out any Pokemon. And, uh, well, that prevents us from getting attacked from Pokemon right here. So I'm going to grab two Lepa Berries, and I'm going to try and go into the upper area right here. I'm not going to battle all the trainers in this episode because it takes quite a while to battle all the trainers, guys. And uh, time is what I don't have, so I'm just going to go with the upper area right here. As you can see, we find ourselves a Pokeball, and there's a Pokemon trainer waiting for us. And, uh, there's more Pokemon right here. And, uh, there we go. We found ourselves another Super Repel. Much needed Super Repel. And, uh, let's see. We go down here. Oh, we can still battle her. Okay. I think we should battle her. Actually, Swamp Lord can, can take this right here. So let's go. Want to determine how strong you are? I'll be the test. I like the way how they, they just think. They assume that they, they can just beat me. I, I love that. I really do. And here we go. Cool trainer Wendy wants to battle. And she's coming out with her Mawile. I think you can capture a Mawile right here. Maybe in Pokemon Ruby. Only in Pokemon Ruby. I, I think so. Yeah, I think so. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. And there we go. Surf attack. For the win. There we go. And she's coming out with a Roselia. So I'm going to go with the man, the myth, the legend. Uh, Raphael the Ninja Turtle right here. I'm going to do this. I'm gonna do this right. I'm gonna burn you. Mm -hmm. So, let's go with a flamethrower. But that magical leaf hits us. Can't believe that Roselia is that small. It's like super small. If you guys check on the Pokedex, it is a very small Pokemon. It really is. It's like my thumb. It is. It is like my thumb. And uh, coming out with a Pelipper, let's go with Noob Saibot right here because Noob Saibot has been waiting for another battle since God knows when. I don't know. So here we go, Noob Saibot, Pelipper right here, Pelipper going for the Thunder. Oh, I'm going for the Thunderbolt. Pelipper's just gonna sit there like a moron, just wondering. Whoa, I didn't know you had Thunderbolt. Wow, I'm dead. Just like that. Boom. Defeated. Just like that. Just like that. And. Uh, well, you passed the, with flying colors. Yes, I have. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, now, I have an option of going down right here and battling those two guys. But, like I said, I'm going to go up here. I've already seen what's down there. And uh, battle that cool trainer just to get to the whatever area right here. Now, he probably has some cool, interesting Pokemon. So, let's go ahead and switch it up to Gaia. It's been a while since I've seen Gaia battle. Let's go. You seem to have a big collection of gym badges. Let me see if you're really actually worthy of those badges. See, like, I, I love how they assume that, you know, I'm weak. I'm nothing. Nothing. And here we go. Cool trainer Braxton wants to battle. He's coming out with his Swellow. And I'm coming with Gaia the Fierce Knight. And, uh, Psychic Attack, right? Psychic Attack. And, uh, that Swellow's growing. Using that, uh, that, what? Whatever attack, I just misread it, whatever. And uh, Psychic Attack wins! Mm-hmm. And uh, he's gonna come out with a Trampage. So that Trampage is gonna have some kind of an advantage against us, I guess. Could be wrong. Hmm. Have we ever seen a Dark-type, Dragon-type Pokemon? Yes, we have. In the Unova region, right? Yeah. Could be wrong, I don't know. It's been a while, guys. There we go. Surf Attack! Surf and Turf Attack, a wins! Uh, look at that, Surf and Turf Attack does its thing. And, uh, coming out, I'm just gonna keep on going. What kind of Pokemon was it coming out? A Shift Tree, Crud! Oh god, okay, so let's go with a Secret Power. See what happens right here. I don't know what attack that was, but it sure took a lot. And this is bad, Giga Drain. Yeah, that's, yeah, pretty fucked up right there. Very fucked up, man, come on! Let's go with the secret power. Mm-hmm. Defeats you. Shiftry. Defeated. Swamp Lord. Victorious. And you're coming out with a Whalemore? Okay, so let's go with Shroomly. 
Shroomly the man, the myth, the legend of Shroomly. All right. I'm gonna use that Giga Drain attack that you used on me because you know what, you're a prick like that. And uh, yeah, look at that. Say goodbye to Wilmer. Critical hit, super effective. Eat it. And Shroomly is uh, fully healed right there. Look at that. And uh, Gaia grows to level 38. That's good. Shroomly growing levels and uh, coming out with a Magneton. So let's go straight back to the man, the myth, the legend, the Raphael, the Ninja Turtle right here. And, uh, well, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. You got nothing. Nothing. Here we go. Flamethrower. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, turtles. Slow. Yeah. Tortoise or whatever. And that took a, that took a lot of HP right there. But hopefully this will take Magnemite out. Come on, take him out. Yes. No sturdy uh, effect right there. Not right now, though. Everybody grows levels in. Look at that. Raphael grows to level 36. This is a good battle. Brax has been defeated. He's like, you're worthy, all right. Yeah, you better think that. Okay, so I'm going to go right here. And, uh, of course, that takes you to that area. And that is a Pokeball. Don't know what Pokeball, what item is. Well, what item that is. And as you can see, you can find three places for secret areas or secret uh, locations and whatnot. Or secret bases. And, uh, huh. Well, I guess that's pretty much what you could find right here. Wow. I thought there was a how. Oh, yeah, I'm thinking of Pokemon Auras. My bad. Yeah, you can find... Yeah, in Pokemon Auras, you can find... Uh... Yeah, you can find a house right here and stuff. And Wow, what was I thinking? Okay, so... I guess I got enough time to battle everybody else. Okay, so I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty, so we're back. Back to where we were. Now we're going to go to the bottom section. I thought I said I wasn't going to do it, but you know what, I also thought there was a house right here, but I'm thinking of another game, so I'm going to go down right here, I already battled you, so now we're going to have a double battle right here, and uh, let's see, let's see, let's actually, you know what, let's put Noob Cybot right next to this guy, because I have a feeling about these guys, alright, let's go, I'll turn your lights out while I'll rip through this tune, oh crud, I have no, I have to tell you, bird Pokemon are my obsession. Uh, 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 obsession, my bad. <laughs> Birds are cool. They're the best. Okay. Alrighty. Wow, you see how I messed up right there? But then again, these guys both look alike. I mean, they should have changed up the whole thing. So here we go. Fernando and Alberto wanting to battle us. Alberto Del, Del, Del Rio and his announcer right here. You know, I'm still thinking of wrestling. So, Skyblade and Noob Saibot ready for battle. And, uh, let's see. Uh, I'm gonna go with that, and I'm gonna go with that right there. So, let's see. Thunderbolt. Will it win? Yes, it will. Just look. Destroys that Pelipper with one hit. How do you like that? It doesn't like that very much. And, uh... Okay, see, let's see. He's coming out with his Zatu, so... This guy's doing no... He's doing himself no justice right here. So, I'm attacking both of these guys. Critical hit, but it's not very effective. And, uh... Alrighty. Okay, so we're 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 do, we're working with fire right here, guys. We're working with something right here. So we're gonna go with another, with well, the same attacks right here. Noob Cybot will just eliminate the Satu very easily, and then we'll just you know gang up on the one Pokemon right here, the Rocker or the Guitarist or whatever. And uh, look at that, everybody's getting experience points. And here we go, Air Cutter on one guy right there. And the reason I'm going with a flying like I'm not, or oh, wow reason why I'm not going with a physical attack is because that guy could have uh, he could yeah it does have static right there don't want that to happen to us and uh, slash attack right there and this guy's finally hitting us but I'm gonna go with psychic attack oh yeah oh yeah that's right mm -hmm. and uh, we got one more Pokemon and he's coming out with his loud dread okay a nice Pokemon but check this out slash attack beats them just like that wow pokemon are getting strong very very strong and would you look at that we defeated both these guys alberto and fernando and uh yeah i don't want to talk to you guys ever again uh, you guys yeah you guys are not that good but this guy he wants he wants to battle me again so that's good it's okay you got you had some pretty good pokemon i hope they evolve later on and uh let's see there's that item that we don't know what it was found ourselves a revival herb which you know can revive your pokemon but it will leave a bitter uh taste on its mouth so be aware of that. It takes some of the happiness points away. 
And uh, let's see. I'm going to go with Shroom Lee. And I'm going to go with Raphael. And what I'm also going to do is i got to heal up Raphael because they might gang up on this guy right here. With the Gangnam style, you know, that kind of stuff. And here we go. Another battle. Don't be too happy if your Pokemon develop psychic powers. You need to refine those powers to make them really useful. Oh, crud. Hello, child. Can you spare some time? Kind of a weird thing to say to me, but okay. All right. Let's see what happens. Let's see. So here we go. Psychic Jackie and Expert Frederick want to battle, and they're coming out with a ca Kadabra and uh, Makuhita. All right. Here we go. Got my Pokemon ready. Ready to kick some butt. And, uh... Oh wow, it doesn't have any more wow, okay. So let's let's go with the strength right here and let's go with Sunny Day. Wow! They take away my oh wow, I, I'm so pissed off at these guys. Okay, so wanted to use my combo! WTF guys! Ugh. Why why would you do that? Nah, well we still got we still got time. We just need to we need to beat these guys quickly because that solar or yeah that that well, whatever attack it's well what was it future sight yeah it's gonna hurt us right now okay so um, there's no PP for that guy um, let's go with that and let's go with a sunny day again there we go sky uppercut and uh, does some good damage right there takes out Lunatone that's good and uh, all right Raphael do that sunny day give me that cheat and uh, vital throw onto our Shroom Lee right there. Not too much, but that sunlight is very, very strong for you. And uh, let's go Solar Beam attack. And let's go with the Flamethrower for whoever wants to come out next. So there it is. Solar Beam. Come on. Takes out Makuhita. And I think we might, we might get hit by that future side attack right about now. Will we? I think... Yeah, we're probably going to get attacked right after this guy comes out. He's looking all, trying to make us flinch. But there's that flamethrower, and luckily we have a sunny day. It boosts up that attack. Goodbye, Macho. So we don't get hit by Future Sight. Not one time. See, the good combination if it works out properly. It's like overwhelmed. Ah, mighty capable child. Let me contribute to your allowance. Oh, okay, so we get an allowance. That's cool. That's awesome. And she wants to face us again. I was kind of thinking that, you know, the expert would want to battle us, but okay, whatever. What do I know? And there we go, a PP up that we will be using for Giga Drain right there. And we've already battled those girls. So that's pretty much it for this episode, guys. Uh, next episode, we will be uh, finding out what's going on with the Team Aqua and Team Magma, you know, BS kind of stuff. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.